Welcome to our channel. Today, we're diving into the position of twins in the womb and what it means for delivery. Just like with single pregnancies, the position of your babies as you approach your due date plays a crucial role in determining the safest way to welcome them into the world. Always consult with your doctor or midwife for personalized advice and guidance throughout your pregnancy journey. Let's start with the most common and ideal position for a vaginal delivery cephalic cephalic. This simply means both babies are positioned head down, ready to greet the world head first. Think of it as the perfect starting line for a smooth delivery. This position is seen in about 40% of twin pregnancies and is the safest for a natural birth. In this scenario, twin A is head down, while twin B is in the breech position. If twin A is head down and ready to go, a vaginal delivery may still be possible. Your doctor will assess the size difference between the twins and the exact position of twin B. Sometimes twin B might even turn head down during labor. However, if there are concerns, a C-section might be the safest option. Here, twin A is in the breech position, while twin B is head down. Because twin A is leading the way and isn't in an ideal birthing position, this scenario often leads to a C-section. The risk of umbilical cord prolapse is higher, and we always want to prioritize the safety of both you and your babies. While a C-section might not have been the original plan, it's a very safe and common procedure. Picture this. Both twins are comfortably hanging out feet first. This position, medically termed breech breech, present significant challenges for a vaginal delivery. With both twins breech, the risks are amplified. Therefore, in almost all breech-breech situations, doctors recommend a planned C-section. Sometimes babies settle into a transverse lie position, lying sideways across the uterus. A vaginal delivery with a baby in a transverse lie is impossible and can be dangerous if labor begins spontaneously. So, when a transverse lie occurs, Especially with twins, a C-section is necessary. Did you know? Twins often touch, kick, or even seem to cuddle each other in the womb. Ultrasound studies have shown that twins may start interacting as early as the 14th week of pregnancy. These early interactions are not just adorable, they actually play a role in their development. The kicks, nudges, and even those tiny hiccups they share all contribute to their sensory and motor development. Thanks for watching. We've covered a lot of ground today about the different positions twins can settle into and how those positions can impact delivery decisions. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more informative content. We're wishing all you expecting parents a happy and healthy delivery. See you next time.